guys, it's Nikki. So it is October, which means that it is Halloween time. And I was so excited to start doing this because this was one of the things that I was really looking forward to when I started my channel, the Halloween tutorials and just being able to do kind of like really random out of the box type things. So um, I'm really happy with the look that I came up with. It's just a really fun, um, just kind of sexy, really deep, smoky eye with some purples and some reds and I did some little glittery lines on the outside and I finished off with a black slash reddish lip. Um, and the face is just really light and glowy. I just thought that this was a really fun tutorial to start off with and, and just so I stop rambling, I'll just get right into it and show you exactly what I've done. I'm going to be using my Leo Ellie BB Cream since it's the lightest foundation that I have and just pat that all over the face. And I'm using my Beauty Blender to put it all on just so it's more of a flawless, even finish. Now I'm using the lightest concealer I have to highlight underneath my eyes and down. That'll just really make your face brighten up. And on the forehead and the chin also to just pull those features out. This is my MAC uh, Soft and Gentle Highlighter and I'm just putting that all over the face to give my skin a really glowy look. And then I'll be using this Makeup Forever HD powder to set everything on it. Now I'm taking this pink highlighter and just using that on my cheeks and up on my brow bone. This is a just a matte bronzer, kind of heavy to chisel out the face a little bit underneath the cheekbone. For the eyes, I'm starting with Too Faced Shadow Insurance, just so everything stays put. And I'm going to be using my Inglot Gel Liner in 77, it's black, any black face will do, and just patting that on my eyelids, it doesn't have to be perfect. And whatever's left over on my finger underneath my eyes also. Now I'm just using a fluffy blending brush to blend, and I'm going to do a lot of blending so it doesn't look so just slapped on there. And I'm bringing that all the way around. This is a sparkly red that I'm going to be putting over the black and it's just going to give it a really deep burgundy look. And blend that all over also. And I'm taking this raspberry purple type color just above the red, just a little bit above the crease and blend that up also and taking that below the eye. And I'm taking a matte black shadow just right in the outer V and pulling it through the crease just to make sure it really is a deep, deep look. And I'm brushing under my eye and in my corners with whatever's left just to give your eyes kind of a sunken effect. And my darkest brown pencil as my brow pencil. And I want to make them just really defined, so I'm going to set that with a dark brown shadow also. And I'm using the pink highlighter again as the highlight underneath the brows and underneath the eyes also. Now I'm going to be drawing on the lines that are going to guide the glitter and really any just fun swirly lines on the side. Kind of just fun. just imitating wings a little bit. I'm going to be using this red glitter from TKB with my LA Splash Eye Eyeshadow Sealer on just a pointed eyeliner brush and I'll be just tracing the line that I've made with the liner and just dipping that same brush into the glitter and putting it over. And This will make sure that the glitter stays all night and it stays in a line. And it just looks cleaner that way. And if you have a glitter liner, you can use that also. Now I'll be taking the same brush wiped off with some um, eye drops and I'm putting that into just a loose silver shadow and just making some extra lines on the outside just for some added sparkle. You can of course do it however you'd like. 
and underneath the eyes in the inner corner also just to really make your eyes pop. And that highlighter in the corner again. I'll take your favorite mascara and do one coat on top and bottom. Now I'm doing a second coat and I'm going to be dipping my finger into this holographic glitter and pressing it into the wet mascara. So again just one coat and then press the glitter right in and it just gives your eyes a really bright fun effect. And I forgot to water or to line my water line and tight line my eyes with just a black liner. And I'm using another black liner as my lip liner and this is just a softer one. This is from Lancome. And I'm going to be bringing the liner onto the inner corner, leaving the middle bare so the red will pop. And I'm going to be blending that out with my finger and just placing a really deep red over everything. And that's finishing it off. Okay guys, so that is it. I hope that you learned some things and I hope that you had as much fun as I did filming it because I had so much fun doing this. Um, don't forget to check out my blog at GourmetGlitterati.com. I will have a full list of products there. Please subscribe for more Halloween tutorials, um, more any kind of tutorials, and I'll talk to you later. Bye guys.